hello. Today, this is Tarleton. So today we'll be on our way right now in Arlington. And we got this pack of cars. Here we go. We flag is out. We'll be on the way right now. The leader is right now. Brakasowski. No, it is Ryan Priest. Priest is in the lead. Need to check on the outside. Inside is is the seven, which is James, which is James Davidson. Chase Elliott down the bottom. Baron to the lead. Here comes here comes Clint Boyer. And today's not playing his day as he just practiced and he has been at the back moment of every single time. The same thing for the 32 today. Let's hope they actually change it. And the lead is still barren. Chase Elliott down the bottom. He's going to get past Clint Boyer. Can he get past Ryan Priest? Ryan Priest is in second. Can Chase Elliott get in front? Yes, sir, he can. Chase Elliott. Here comes Kurt Busch. Still going to be side by side. The battle for second place. And the battle for second place might be over. Wait, no, they're still battle for it. Here comes Custer with pull down the bottom. Chase Elliott loses many positions. Kurt Busch in second place. Third place is, is, is Cole Custer. All rookies in front. They got wide space. Very wide space right there. And they can try to attack it. They can try to attack it pretty good, but unless there might be a caution pretty badly, and he actually might save it. At the back is Alex Bowman. He has not had a good summer. He has not had a good season. He has not also had a good last season. He never got a win. But can he change that today? I mean, he, he did have one win this season, but he just fall down in the summertime. Can he actually like, make it feel like it's the early season again? We'll figure it out, but right now, Baron's still in the lead, Kurt Busch, they're still in the same spots, but here comes Chase Elliott, back where he belongs, and fourth place, Kurt Busch down the bottom, some cars are willing to pit in, three cars that pit it in, Eric Lormia, Matt in the middle, and, 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 Chris, and Christopher Bell. I bet about the name stakes. I sometimes forgot about them. Here comes Kurt Busch in second. He's still trying to hold it on. The battle for first place is still continuing. Kurt Busch, he can't, he can't make it enough. He'll still, he still will be behind. They're going to be side by side. I think there are, but then they're side by side. But it's still a bump draft. When they bump draft to the end, wait no. Kurt Busch just side by side. Kurt has taken the lead. Really Brown trying to get it back. On the outside, down up. Focus on the back of the back. We're all we're T. Y. Dillon, John Nemechek, and Ryan and Truex Jr. Martin Truex. Why I said Ryan Truex? Have no idea, but they're, but they're racing pretty hard and trying to get back in the front. Here goes Berman. Berman to the lead again. Chase Elliott third. Fourth is Paul. Cole has has missed many positions as he's now right here, right behind Tim Hill. Kurt Busch has took him back to lead. It's the battle for first place. Chase Elliott and Poole are in the battle in first place. Chase Elliott in second. Can you try to climb back? Baron will climb back. This is the battle for first place of the stage. By the way, there are 50 laps. So this is um, the seventh lap. And, and this stage has like 15 laps. 11th lap, here we come. Chase Elliott for the, for the lead. We'll focus on the... On the drivers that are starting from the back, Matt in the bendo, starting from the way behind, he's going to have to catch up pretty more from this race. At the win stage end, he better have plans, otherwise he's going to be back there forever. Same thing with Joe Lagano, he's alone, and he has no help or anything. The same thing, you can see Christopher Bell on the outside, is losing, is losing positions. But here comes Chase Elliott in the lead, as always. Kurt Busch in second, third place Poole, fourth place Daniel Suarez, fifth place Redick, but now it turns. Now the top five has changed. 13 of 15. Chase Daly might hold the stage win, but if Kurt Busch can actually catch up, he won't win the stage. 14 out of 15 of the stage, which is two to go. Can Chase Daly hold on for the stage? 
Chase Elliott might hold on for the stage. The last stage lap is, is going to come in, and Chase Elliott is still leading. The positions have never changed, but except for the back a little bit. Chase Elliott will win the stage, probably. Kurt Busch has no help. Kurt, I mean, Chase Elliott will win the stage. I was going to say Kurt Busch won the stage. I don't know why. But here they come. They're going to line up again and get ready for stage two, which is another 15 laps. Which means 30 laps, and then they do 20 laps by themselves with the final stage. Everyone gets came in. We're ready for stage two. And we're underway. Let's see who takes the lead. It looks like Daniel Suarez has, and I was correct. Here comes Paul down the bottom. Chase Elliott loses many positions. Here comes Carl Joy. He might actually change his race for the practice. He might take the lead. But here comes Christopher Bell. They're going three wide, four wide. This is the same as everyone's just fighting for the lead. But also they're doing at the way back. Here comes Joe Logano. Jo Joe Logano to the lead. Here comes the help from the 8 and the 95. They're all pushing two wide. They're spreading. They're spreading. They still have a chance to win this race. Carl Joy in front, Joe Logano second. This is like the craziest pack you ever might see in Darts in history, a pen series history, which is called Menard. I changed the name of the series. Cole Custer, he actually might lose a position. Oh, he's gonna go on the outside. He's gonna lose many positions again, just like Chase Elliott. The slow's gonna chase Elliott stage one winner. He is right behind Kyle Busch. Bush is helping out the two and the forty and the thirty-four. The fifty feet has like a sight of help from the thirty from the thirty-four. But, but they might not hang on. And look at this. James Jamison in the lead. Cards are gonna put in. Some will not. Denny Hamlin avoids the pits. Come on. This is six out of fifteen on the number stage. Joe Lagan still fighting for the first place stop spot. We can see this pack is pretty awesome right here. We have the back is Bubba Wallace. Oh, here's Wayne. Oh, what is Bubba Wallace doing? He flew over the map to try to get in front of the last of the pack. Well, that's unfortunate, and he's going to fall back behind again. Let's go back up to the front. As you can see, people are still fighting for first place, and I think the seven is still in first place. Wait, I was wrong. Joe Logano leads, but they're going to have to pit in. They need to pit right now. Yeah, they're starting to run out of fuel. Now the pack is very wide, and Joe Logano has like the huge lead that I've ever seen in Darrington. He has like a huge lead. He might actually win the stage. It's like 10 out of 15. Five laps to go on the stage. He has like the wise lead. He's definitely going to win the stage. But unless something happens, four laps to go on the stage. Going around as they used to every single time. Joe Logano could win the stage. As this is a big, big pack. Some cars might be left by Joe Logano. Free to go on the stage. So I'm going to second place spotter, which is Corey Joy. Look at Poole. They're, they're working up together to get in front, but, not, but there's not enough laps to go here. I think this is two laps to go, and it is. Trying to get one to go here so Joe Logano can win the stage. Joe Logano is going to have one lap to go on the stage. This is all Joe Logano. Unless the tire blows out and crashes. And then that's going to allow Poole to win, to win the stage. But nothing's going on here as Joe Logano wins the stage as, as there was like a big, big lead for him. Now, now Joe Logano will pit on the, on the, on the final stage. Definitely he will pit. Everyone's lining back up perfectly. At the back was Denny. Everyone's gonna catch up again, and you know sometimes the leader fades away. 
And you know that's sometimes a problem for the team. Just like Chase Elliott, but he's back up in there. Green is out. We have Cora Joy, Jimmy Johnson. Oh, wait, no, that was not Jimmy Johnson. That was, that was someone else. That was, that was, um, Chase Elliott. Here comes Kyle Busch trying to get in the lead here, and he does. His race is granted. Oh, here comes Greg Slavsky taking the lead. Look at Reed Sorsen in a second. He has one race that charted. Finished for the Indy. He's in the playoff spot. Just like the other cars who won, who won this season. Greg Kozlowski had a bad race at New Hampshire last time. But, but he's not affecting his race, so he might actually do good. He did practice out a lot. At the way far back is the 78 of Bradley Curry. He is going to have to catch up. And he has long... Just like Alex Bowman, who was just up there. And same thing with Kyle Busch, they just all fade away because they're on the outside wall. And usually you don't have to stay on the outside long wall for, for a long time. I think everyone's going to pay for it except for some. Here they come. They're going to enter the pits. Ooh, they're, they're entering the pits pretty good. But some of the pits have stopped. Now Justin Helley leads. He's leading the game. But here comes Eric Jones and Chase Elliott. Do you see Alex Bowman up in fourth? Fifth place is Bradley Curry. Red Kislowski in fifth. That was like a quick pit stop for everyone who pitted. At the back was was Quinn Howe. I think this is already ten or nine, maybe eight actually. But Justin Howe is still leading. White with. 14 to go. Wait, no. My, my mistake again. 16 to go. Gotta get the numbers correctly. Come on. Alright, 9 out of 20. That should be 11 laps to go. Alright. Get my numbers together, Aaron. Come on. Oh, God. I exposed my real name. Come on. Alright. Chase Elliott leads. But never mind. Chase Elliott gets back to lead. My gosh. This is, this is sometimes a hard race to watch if you want your favorite driver to win the game. Chase Elliott, still trying to get help from the 20. But watch the 77. The 77 is going to pit in about any minute. He's going to pit in right now, and Justin Helley will lose his lead. And he's going to give it up for Chase Elliott. Wait, no, they're, they're going to pit. And the lead is Alex Bowman. Ryan Newman second. Third place is Chris Busker. Fourth place, Denny Hamlin. Fifth place is Ricky Sinhouse. Those are the top five. 11 out of 20. Can Bowman hold this lead or he will fade away? Just like the drivers who had to pick. And the drivers who was at the lead are now back here with the 9 all the way from the back. The 78 all the way from the back. Yep. Alex Bowman still leading. Chris Busker is having like a great race. He has to get he has to get in first place with the help of Ryan Newman and Ricky Stenhouse. Gotta get that push so far. Here comes during the lead, but it's gonna fade away as there, as this is a battle. Kurt Busch is in another battle. He finished second, right behind Chase Elliott in the first stage. They're going free wide, too wide. It's still too wide. Kurt Busch couldn't make it free wide because he was too late to get up there. You can see this lead's pretty good. Oh, someone goes to the outside wall. Ricky Stenhouse trying to lead. It's a free wide. Ricky Stenhouse will lead the game, but some are going to put it in again. Oh, it's someone having a tire pressure. Something's going on with someone's tires, and I think that's the 51 and the 38. They gotta fix their tires together. Chris Busker leads. Ricky, they still try to get the lead back. They do, but it's not enough. But Kurt Busch. All right, here we go. 15 out of 20. Kurt Busch in the lead. I knew he was gonna do it good. I knew it. Here comes the 22. The zero on the outside wall. Mm -hmm. Because also some of the cars are left, which is T. Y. Dillon and Kyle Busch. Kurt Busch in the lead. Here they, they're coming more. More than ever. More than ever. More than fast. More than ever. 
17 out of 20. Or 16. But anyway, Kurt, Kurt Bush still in the lead. Here comes Chris Bush. They're trying to get it. But here, oh, what a move by Alex Bowman. What a move. Just what a move by Alex Bowman. This will come down pretty quickly. But can you hold on? And we have a new car adapt, which is which is Eric Lamia. Now, Boom Baron trying to escape the lap part. But it's not going to be enough, as he's going to be also lapped, apparently, for some reason. Alex Moment, still in the lead. Kurt Busch, second place. It is like two, wait, no, three to go. Kurt, here comes Chris Buster. Buster for the lead, and he gets it. It's still a battle, no matter what. Kurt Busch, it's a, it's a battle. It's a battle. It's another battle. And Alex Bowman's going to lose the battle right there. He might actually fall. We have no clue. Ricky Stenhouse and Ryan Newman still trying to hang in there for the top five. But Blaney and Jim Johnson are doing harder than ever. This is the last lap, I think. And Chris Busker... He could come off with a third. His second win, third. He's going to get his third win today at Darlington. Unbelievable, unbelievable race today. That is like a great race today as the 13th finished last today. And this was a good race for Darlington. As he got past 50 laps, I think. 50 laps. Did we assist the final lap for real? Oh, we already did the final lap. Never mind. So, Chris Bush wins the, the game. And we have, we have the 13 at the back. And the 13 has not had a good race. As the 17 will go to victory lane right now. As the, uh, as the other cars will watch them do the victory. But some are going to come back out as always. Just like New Hampshire. But what a game. What a ride for the 17 he is saying but there's no fans but he imagine that there was fans there good job to the winner it's good job and and thank you for attending this game with Darrington from watching home and all you people make sure to stay safe from the coronavirus and make sure you don't get a fire out of your house because there's been a lot of fire that where I live and let me tell you it's like it's like awful but just to make sure you have a safe time, and I'll see you later. Goodbye.